Hey guys, welcome to Flat Top Team. <laughs> hey guys, welcome to the Flat Top King. <laughs> <laughs> flat Top King. Hey guys, welcome to the Flat Top King. Today we're making a twist on the classic. Eggs with a hole in the middle. Whatever you call it, we're gonna upgrade it from here to here. We're gonna do a loaded egg in the hole middle breakfast sandwich. You guys ready? Let's go. There's a lot of verbiage out there, right? So whether it's eggs in a basket, birds in a nest, eggs in a nest, you know, you name it. The classic is basically just bread. You take a hole out of it, you put an egg in there and you cook it. But we thought we were like, man, it's so, it, it's so easy. Let's just make it so good. So now we're gonna take two of them, fry up some bacon. I got some smoked um, breakfast sausage that we're gonna try out today. It's brand new, it's not my traditional Tennessee prod. Eggs and cheese, we're keeping it simple and we're putting it all in the pit boss griddle this morning. Let's go. First things first, we're gonna start cooking the sausage and bacon. All right, we got our griddle loaded down. We're just gonna cook the bacon and the uh, sausage just until it's done the way you guys like it. Uh, as you know, it'll probably be about an hour, hour and a half from now, but TV time, probably like five seconds because we have to make sure this bacon is. Bacon dust. Thank you. <laughs> it really doesn't take an hour to make it. Our meat's on the griddle. I'm gonna show you guys a quick, easy way to do this. I used to have a really incredible um, biscuit cutting set. Somehow we lost it in translation or trans, uh, what's it called? Moving from Wyoming back to Knoxville, but oh well. All right, so now I've just got a third cup measuring cup. Obviously the size of the cup is gonna matter depending on how big your bread is. So just kind of stamp it down a little bit. It's not a big deal. And I'll just take a paring knife. Nobody's judging you. Right, and it's just the uh, the process of just getting the uh, the little bread out there. Now, if you've done this before, you know you always save this because for some reason, this is like the best piece in the whole thing. If you guys haven't seen it, I got a mail call a couple of days ago, and uh, Alan hand carved some of these wooden tools for me to, to use on my uh, griddle. So we're testing them out for the first time. Holy smokes, these bad boys are like look at my surface area I'm taking up. That's what I'm talking about. Alan, I thank you. I thank you, buddy. Like two swoops and you're done. <laughs> and it's got a nice long handle. Keep your hand off the heat. All right, find you a couple good landing pads. Woo. And put just a little bit of extra butter in there for your uh for your eggs. Don't forget about these little doohickeys. It's like the best thing on there. Doohickey. <laughs> I wonder if that's a southern word. Uh -huh. Somebody commented from the north that they were absolutely in tears laughing because I said the word golly, and they said they haven't heard that. I don't even know if they've heard it or they haven't heard it in a long time. And I was like, you think that word's funny? You should watch me do my intro. <laughs> <laughs> it takes them like five takes to say, welcome to the Flat Top King. <laughs> <laughs> a little salt, a little pepper. All right, like any time I tell you, if you butter the first side, you might as well butter the next side. So let that butter melt. Get a good landing pad. Let's move that butter over just a hair. Mix in some of that bacon grease. It won't take long, just go and throw your cheese on it, just like that. All right, obviously you're gonna cook it the way you like your eggs. You like your eggs hard, you're gonna cook it longer. Heck, you could even scramble eggs inside of it. You can do it before or actually while it's in there. It's up to you. This is how we're gonna load this mamber jammer. We're gonna light on the bacon. That's light on the bacon. <laughs> uh -huh. And then we're gonna light on the sausage. <laughs> now 
Now that has got to rival that breakfast burger sandwich. We I made. don't know. That breakfast uh, burger was fantastic. Oh, this, this, oh, this is what I get you. This is what I get you. Oh, that looks good, honey. That's a perfectly cooked egg. All right, guys, there you go. Hey, egg in the hole in the middle, taking up a notch, a level, a staircase, a floor, it and then down the belly. Fantastic, honey. All right, let's see what we got here. Let's just see. Now, my wife said off camera that she likes her eggs just a little bit more runnier. And although I agree, when you're eating a sandwich, you don't want it squirting out the front and the back because then you lose everything. Or you could just make a dipping sauce, but we did let it go a hair longer than what we wanted to. That looks good. Let me, where's my bite? Mm. You gotta feed me. It's low carb. <laughs> <laughs> Should we call this the healthier breakfast sandwich? Well, I mean, you are cutting out some of the bread. <laughs> we cut out the man in the middle. Uh, where's it? Where is it? Right there. <laughs> okay. All right. All right, big old mouth. Looks good, honey. Mm. 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 Uh oh. Mm. Uh oh. Mm. That bacon was dust. That wouldn't happen like that. Oh, you didn't get my bacon dust. Was it as good as the breakfast burger? That that breakfast burger was hard to beat. That is good though. But we got different sausage, and I actually like the sausage. Like, do I like it better than my traditional? No. Absolutely. I think it's fantastic. It, it just shows you, hey, just play with your food. Come up with stuff. Just make stuff different. That's what it's all about. Last but not least, find us on The Griddle Group on Facebook. What are you guys making? What are you guys doing? We love it when you guys tag us. We love it when you guys make something. Comment. We have all kinds of people on there to help you guys out, especially for beginners. If you're interested, we have a join, below, a join button down below. More than welcome for you guys to check that out just kind of like helps out the channel. We get behind the scenes footage, yada, 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 yada. Last but not least, thank you. Thank each and every one of you. Don't forget to press that subscribe button, pound the notification button, share it with your friends. Just make something. Peace. Mm.